Processional 212 was... Be careful, Loris. You know how dangerous I close... In every direction, rows and rows of... to the future, or so a friend once said to me. I did not believe it then. I do now. The past walks with us. Its face is the face of all those we have hated. All we have loved, all we have failed. They say that to be an agent of the Imperial Inquisition is to see the true horror of the universe and still have the will to prevail. As with all things, there is another face to the truth. I have looked on the terrors of the universe and cast them down. I have judged billions and forgiven some. I have known victory touched defeat and the lesson that all my years as an inquisitor have taught me is that it is not enough to prevail we have to endure the poison of history we have to survive our own sins my name is Gregor Eisenhorn and these deeds were mine Hunting the recidivist Murdin Iclone, I came to Hubris in the dormant of 240.M41, as the Imperial Sidereal Calendar has it. Dormant lasted 11 months of Hubris's 29 and month lunar year. I had heard of the bitter cold and prayed to the Emperor that I would never feel it again. Stay back. Processional 212 was a hibernation tomb at the west end of the Great Imperial Avenue. It housed 12,142 members of the hubris ruling elite.
Be careful, Loris. You know how dangerous Iclone is. He's an animal. A dangerous one, but we'll put him down. We have him cornered. That'll make him more of a threat than ever. Watch your back. I admit I was excited, eager to close and conclude a business that had lasted six years. Iclone had evaded me for six whole years. I studied his methods every day and dreamed of him every night. Now, I could smell him. In every direction, rows and rows of ice berths ranged down the smooth basalt chambers. It was like walking into the Imperium's grandest moor. All my life, I have had a reputation for being cold, unfeeling. I am not, but I...
Eisenhorn? Gregor, is that you? The dead, you know.